Hello everyone, welcome to Automation Community. Today, in this video, we are going to discuss an example which will be about automatic pumping and draining. So, let's look at the example first. Automatic pumping and draining. When start push button is pressed and released, then the pump should run for 20 seconds to fill the tank and then drain valve should open for 10 seconds to drain the tank. When stop push button is pressed and released, the system will stop immediately. So for this example, we will use normally open contacts and normally close contacts. We will be also using memory bits and some timers like TP and T on. So let's move to TI portal where we will draw a ladder diagram for this example. This is the interface of TI portal. Firstly, we will go to PLC tags, then default tag table. So here we need to add our inputs and outputs. So the first input is start push button and then we have stop push button as well. Stop push button and then we have two outputs pump and drain valve. So this will be pump. So the address of the pump will start with Q, then 0, 0.0 and then we have one more output that is drain wall. After that, we'll move to program blocks, then main OB1, I will double click on it. So here we will be drawing ladder diagram. So firstly, I will insert a normally open contact for start button and a coil for a memory bit. So this will be start push button and then this coil will be memory bit M0.0 .0. and then as it is a push button so we will implement latching here. So I will insert a normally open contact here. Firstly, I will open the branch at a normally open contact, then close and this will be M0.0. .0. And after that, we will use one more normally open contact for a stop push button. So this will be stop push button and then there will be a coil that will be another memory bit say M0.0 .0, and then I will latch it here. So I will open the branch at a normally open contact and then close. So this will be M0.1 and after that this M0.0 .0 will be used this M0.1 will be used to turn on the pump so I will insert a coil also so this is M0.0 .0, and then this coil is for pump but this pump should operate only for 20 seconds so I will use a timer operation TP here, click on OK and the pulse timer will be 20 seconds. And then this pump will turn off if stop push button is pressed. So when uh, this M0.1 will be used here as normally close contact. So this will be M0.1 here. And then after 20 seconds, after the pump will turn off, then a drain valve should operate. For that, we will, uh, we will use network 4 and then I will insert a normally open contact for this M0.0 .0 and then a coil for drain valve. So there is a coil here for drain valve, drain valve. So I will delete this coil here and then this drain valve should operate after 20 seconds. So I will use T on here, click on OK, and this will be 20 seconds. So after 20 seconds, drain valve will operate, will get activated, and it will operate for 10 seconds. So for that, we will use a timer here, TP, and the preset value will be 10 seconds. So now let's start the simulation. And then I will click on load and then finish. And after that, 
I will just start the CPU and then start monitoring. After that, I will switch to the project view here. Here we need to create a new project. I will press Ctrl N and then enter. So it is creating the project. Now I will go to simulation tables and then simulation table 1. I will right click here and then load project tax. So as you can see here, when I when start push, but push button is pressed and then release, this M0.0 .0 gets through and when this M0.0 .0 gets through, pump gets on. And it will get on for 20 seconds. <clears throat> and after 20 seconds, it will turn off and drain valve will operate for 10 seconds. As you can see here, after 10 seconds, it gets off. And after 10 seconds, it gets off. So if I turn on again the start push button, press and release. So pump gets on. When I turn on start push button, this pump gets on and if I press stop push button and then release, pump gets off. And also drain valve will not operate. You can see here we will wait. After 20 seconds the drain valve will not operate as we have, as you can see here, we have pressed the stop push button. So it was all about this example. Thank you for watching.